The educators at Holy Cross work hard to ensure the success of their students and are filled with the spirit of Christ's love, creating a warm family environment amongst the students and staff. There's this pervasive sense of caring. And when you're sending your child to school, we're entrusting them to people that are going to spend more time with them during their waking hours than we do. The teachers here care about all of the students, not just the ones in your classroom. And I feel like it's my job to teach them that learning is fun, and I want to instill that in them for the remainder of their academic career and even their life. So I try to remember what I felt like as a student and try to be the teacher that I love to go to every day. I think what attracts me to Holy Cross as a teacher is having that opportunity to share and witness my Catholic faith. We can address not only the academics, but we can address the, the virtues and the faith life and the soul of the students. It's just a community that I don't ever want to leave. I, and I feel very lucky to teach here and I don't see myself leaving until I retire. And you can tell that that holds true with the other teachers because as an educator, you kind of look at teacher retention and there's teachers that have been here for over 20 years. Um, I also hope that they make improvements um, academically, obviously, but um, just in their everyday life that they grow in my classroom and um, just in life. I hope that they, that they leave the classroom knowing that, that I love them, that they're loved by the school, and that Jesus loves them. With small class sizes and technology infused into every classroom, students look forward to their time learning and growing in Christ. Academically, Holy Cross is excellent. We know that they're getting the academic foundation that we want and that they need, and it's, it's at the upper end of, of state scores. I feel that when my son entered a Catholic high school, I feel he was very prepared. I have three children at St. James High School, and uh, they all are doing really, really well academically with their studies. And um, our students always perform higher than the public school students around us that are entering those schools. And also, they perform high in comparison to the other Catholic schools here in the area. This is top notch academic wise. Like I've never seen a middle school where I can teach the kids, you know, eighth grade, they're doing factoring, they're doing exponential functions, they're solving exponential equations, things like that. I've never been somewhere where I can push them like that with so little resistance from the kids. Like they want to learn more, which I love. It's something that surpasses just feeding them information and letting them grow in knowledge. They're also growing in, in their soul and who they are. That's what you're going to get when you come to Holy Cross. You're going to get that religious education. You're going to get to know Jesus Christ in a personal way. And you're going to get the academic skills you need to move on to high school and be successful. At Holy Cross, our faith provides a seamless connection to the world around us, a common thread that connects all learning and aspects of life. I think one of our biggest goals is to get kids to heaven. That's why we're here. And in doing, getting kids to heaven, we're going to teach them about their Catholic faith. We're going to teach them about having a relationship with Jesus Christ. And we're going to emphasize strong academics because we know they need that for the world around them. The school is helping us to instill the type of values that we want them to model as adults. You know, giving them as much of their faith, um, being around Jesus all the time, to me that's way more important. So. Um, when you see the eighth graders walking hand in hand with the kindergartners through the neighborhood to the, to the church, it kind of gives a different feel for that community and that bond. And when you walk in the building, you feel Christ's presence. And it's a small community. And we take care of each other, and we watch out for each other, and Jesus is the center of that community. There are plenty of opportunities for enrichment outside the classroom here at Holy Cross, with many quality enrichment programs to choose from. There's a lot of extra activities, and that was one of the other things that we considered when we looked at the schools. There's CYO, which is Catholic Youth Organization, and they, those are from third through eighth grade. Those are the different sports every year that they do, you know, basketball, volleyball, track, all that stuff. And it's an opportunity for all the kids to play together. It's very open for all kids at all levels. You get to know a lot of the parents in the stands and you're rooting for each other. We've had you know, soccer teams together 
that we've had since kindergarten through eighth grade. It wasn't about being the best athlete or being the smartest kid. It was about community. It was about helping each other grow. Um, I did volleyball and basketball this year. I was part of the quiz bowl team and I'm a part of choir so we sing at mass sometimes. I'm in volleyball and basketball and then um, one thing that one of our classes that we do is band. Band is a good opportunity for kids to try musical instruments and you, be, you feel more accomplished as you uh, play. I walked the halls, I saw the students interacting with one another, I got to hear the kids as they played, I got to hear the, the band program and I realized that it was a special music school but it was also a special school in general too. Holy Cross makes your child's faith-based education affordable. With several financial support options available, we are able to work with families who need it most. We have a guardian angel fund that generous people from our parish and community donate to to help offset the cost of tuition for parents who are struggling. Um, and that's been a big help for a lot of our families. As a family, it can be difficult at times. My wife and I, you know, it forces us to prioritize you know, our finances, okay, we're going to send our children to a Catholic school. Well, what sacrifices do we have to make in order to do that? And I think sometimes, you know, having those discussions at home is, not, it is a positive thing because it forces us to have those conversations and to put priorities on, on what, we, what we think is best for our family. And the school works with you, and there's financial aid available, and it's about sacrifice, and it's what's important. What do we want for our children? What is it worth to give them a foundation academically, spiritually, that's sound, that's going to set them off on a better life path? If you want to send your kids to a Catholic school, the finances should not be a hindrance to that. Uh, the, the school will work with you, the church will work with you. God always makes a way. That's how I was raised and that's what I truly believe that if that's where he wants your kids, it will happen. Experience the difference of Holy Cross. Visit us today.